Every female pussy has a distinct taste and a distinct smell. <laughs> Dave, Dave, Mo. You know I gotta take this on some serious note, y'all, cause I do this health shit, man. So on a serious note, cause that shit was funny. All women are not supposed to have no distinct smell or odor, period. You know what I mean? You got something called tritholamine that actually is a bacteria, which is the cause of a lot of odors. You know what I'm saying? It's a bacteria, which is actually a gas. So this also causes headaches. So now you got gas in your body. So look this up. Again, it's called tritholamine. And long story short, um, these bacteria, which are, you know, closely related with methane and all this and ammonia, is what gives you this odor and fishy smell. Then you got other things like yeast, which men carry to and we give back to women. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm not pinning it all on women. I'm just letting y'all know. You know what I'm saying? As funny as this may be, it's not that. You know what I mean? And I'm vegan and the mother of my child is vegan. You know what I mean? So, and I mean it's facts. I'm not with her and we not together today, but it's facts when I say that her pussy's still water. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, she's vegan. So, it, you are what you eat. So, I guess the long story short, what I'm telling you is, especially when you look up tritholamine, you'll find out a lot of this methane and ammonia is coming from these extra proteins that y'all eating, that your body can't metabolize. You're eating a lot of proteins that you don't need. <clears throat> so when you start balancing your dietary, you know, your metabolism and your dietary plan, right? You know, your your odor and your natural, even your underarms will smell better. But I mean, this is the stuff that, you know what I'm saying? We don't know.